Welcome, this is Wrapped from Mind of a Raptor. Today we're going to look at going through the Over the Wire Capture the Flag series. And we're going to be looking at the Natas challenges and specifically getting from level 4 to level 5. So the first thing we need to do is go to the Natas website and log in. So we're going to go Natas 4 because that's the level we're trying to do. And we're going to log in with Natas 4 as a username and the flag that we caught on the previous level. Okay. Once we're logged in, we can prove that we're logged in because we've got Natas 4 in the top left corner. And we can see that we've got a message here which reads as Access disallowed. You are visiting from speech marks while authorized users should come only from um, and what looks like Natas 5 link. So that's a bit weird because it's telling us to go to Natas level 5 to come back to level 4. Um, there's a refresh hyperlink. Yep, so it's a hyperlink. So if we click that, it refreshes a page. Um, you can see now it's saying Natas 4 the, or the Natas 4 hyperlink inside of the speech marks. Um, what we'll do is, by the side of things, it wants us to come from somewhere else, so maybe we need to start looking at intercepting the traffic and seeing what has been sent from the website and back to the website as you're refreshing the page. So, to do this, what we would normally use is a tool called Burp Suite. Um, this is installed by default on the Parrot OS operating system. Um, so we've got Burp Suite open. If you go from the dashboard to proxy, and then make sure you're on intercept. So this one here on the left. And if we turn the intercept on, then what we'll be able to do is intercept the traffic as it's coming through the computer and going to the website. Um, we need to also amend our network proxy. Um, so we need to take it off direct internet connection and put a manual proxy configuration in. We're going to leave it as HTTP proxy as a local host, which is 127.0.0.1. Um, suite on this computer is running over port 8080. I'm going to hit close, and we're just going to close the network config. Now we should hopefully see some information start to appear in here if we refresh this page. So we'll click refresh. We can see that it's hanging in the top left-hand corner here. So if we go back to Burp Suite. And we can see there's data in Burp Suite. Now you've got two options here. You can forward the data or you can drop the data. If you drop it, nothing will happen. The website will just fail. Um, so we'll hit drop. And we'll see what happens. There you go. So there's an error. Alternatively, if we just refresh again, we can hopefully see that the data is coming back through again. And if we hit forward, we should see that the website loads just as it was. So you can see that... Burp Suite is intercepting the traffic, so now we can start looking at what traffic is being intercepted. So let's refresh that page again. We'll click the refresh page link. It'll hang. We'll go back to Burp Suite, and we can see that there is data in here. So one of the key factors when it comes to websites and trying to solve this problem is there's a metadata or a meta tag called referrer, which tells a website where or a server where you've came from before loading this site so what's referred you to that web page um, and it says here natas4 and what it's asking for in the challenge is natas5 so if we get rid of the index.php and then if we change the 4 to a 5 and then hit forward it should hopefully forward that data straight over to the website the website should load and we can see we've been given a flag so the password access granted the password for natas5 is and here's the flag. So what we'll do is we'll just copy the flag. We'll go back to Burp Suite. We'll turn intercept off. And we will just test this flag to make sure it's right by going to Natas5. And we will enter the username Natas5. And we'll drop the flag in that we've just got. And we can see that we are logged in even though it's saying disallowed. You're not logged in. You've got Natas5 here. This message here just relates to the next challenge. Okay, so um, if you've got any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below.